everyone and welcome back to another building tutorial where today we are going to be building the interior of the robot repair tech factory so let's get into it now here are all the materials you are going to need please make sure you have access to all these materials and enough of them so let's get them we got birch you want to get birch signs Birch fences, birch stairs, birch buttons, birch trap doors, blue stained glass, blue stained glass panes, beacons, barrels, brown choker boxes, black concrete, black wool, block of gold, chests, chains, chiseled quartz, chiseled stone bricks, diorite walls, end rods, flower pots, firework stars, glow item frames, glass, gray shulker box, green shulker box, glass panes, grindstones, iron doors, light gray carpet, loom, lever, ochre frog light, painting, polished blackstone pressure plates, polished blackstone brick stairs, and polished blackstone brick slides. And we'll come back and get these later. So... Where we left off last time, it is pretty dark in here, so we're going to need to change that up. Oh, you don't need your iron doors, because we kind of already placed them, but you do want to get your stone brick walls. So let's see. So you first want to go to the top corner. I'm going to get my. You also want to get yourself some night vision if you want to you know, see. You want to go to this corner where we left off last time. And skip five blocks. Skip about six blocks. One, two, three, four, five. And then we place three gold blocks like this, three gold blocks like this, three gold blocks like that. And I made a hole accidentally. You then want to place another three gold blocks. You want to fill it in with gold blocks. And you want to place a beacon. Once you've placed down your gold blocks and beacon, you want to surround the beacon with another few gold blocks. I do apologize, there's going to be a lot of running back and forth, because I do not remember that well. So you can then get rid of your gold blocks and beacons and grab your other materials like polished andesite and a wood skeleton skull. Then want to place eight blacks, eight polished andesite like this. Place blue stained glass in the middle. Place a blue stained glass on the top, and you can then get rid of those materials. 
because you won't be needing them anymore. And you want to go back, grab these but grab your buttons and your polished andesite stairs. And you just want to surround this just like this. And let me just check real quick. Oh yeah, you also want to you also want to grab some polished blackstone bricks. You want to re you actually want to re grab your polished andesite. Sorry guys. And you want to place three like this. You want to place a lever here so that you can get out of your door. Then you can finish stop using your polished andesite blocks. You want to go back in here and place down some polished andesite stairs. I am constantly going to need this. You then want to go to the top corners over here and place some ochre frog lights and underneath and then you want to place trapdoors along the side so it covers it. You want to grab back your, you want to grab out your polished black stone and your ochre frog lights and birch trap doors again. And you want to go to your top corner again. You want to skip one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You want to get into block nine. So you basically want to skip eight and then you want to drag it across the other side of the ceiling. Place ochre frog lights like this and skip two blocks and place another ochre frog light. I'm pretty sure anyways. Okay, no, I did it wrong. So you actually want to skip three blocks and place it over here. Skip two blocks and place it over here, skip another two blocks and place it over here, skip another two blocks and place it over here. And then you just want to cover them with birch trap doors. There you go. And once you've done that, you want to go to the top corner at the end again. You want to skip three blocks and place it here. Skip another three blocks and place it here. And then you want to drag it across the roof again like that. You want to drag this part across the roof. Again. There you go. And you basically want to do what you, the same thing you did for the first light. Skip three blocks, place an ochre frog light, skip two blocks, place an ochre frog light, skip two blocks, place an ochre frog light, skip two blocks and place an ochre frog light. You do the same thing and you do the same thing on this side. done cover the sides with with birch trap doors
and there you go. Those are the lights on the black polished stone, polished black stone bricks done. We'll do the catwalk later. But you still want to keep your polished black stone. Anyways, you want to then Over here, you want to place a polished black. No, over here you want to place polished black stone. Place it. Place a with a skeleton skull black backwards, and place a lever that looks like a security camera. And you don't need your with skeleton skulls anymore. So then, on the beacon again, you want to place polish black stone b buttons on the side. You want to cover this side, and you want to cover the buttons. And you want to get the darkish blue painting, like that. You want to cover the buttons again, and replace it, and then... You want to get Oh, I had that painting for a second. You want to get the painting that looks like it it looks like peppers. You know? Get that one. Ah! This is going to get annoying. Yes, you want to get this painting over here. And then, I need more of this. So you want to go into the top right corner of your build and place, I think, s you want to place four and then place, I think, five? Or am I wrong? My memory is a stupid thing. Okay, no, you actually have to get that. And then on this side, Okay, you basically want to stretch until the door. You basically want to stretch down. You basically want to stretch it all the way down here. Just like that. Then place... Okay, so you're supposed to add... So then... You want to place four glow item frames on this side, another four like this, and then grab your gray, light gray fireworks stars and place them in all of the glow item frames so that it looks like the conveyor belt is actually rolling. So you can then get rid of your item frames and fireworks star. You want to grab your stone brick, smooth stone, and smooth stone slab. Grab 
grab these four blocks out in your green shulker box. I'm pretty sure you only need to place one. Yep. Okay, you actually don't need these iron frames or firework stars. You can get rid of them. But basically, you want to place stone brick stairs like that and green shulker box like that. And you're done with the green shulker box. And in this corner, you want to place five chiseled stone bricks like that and fill it in with smooth stone. And place a smooth stone slab so it looks like a little turntable. get rid of these blocks. I'm pretty sure you don't need your stone brick anymore. Yep, you don't. So then, you want to grab your polished deep slate blocks and your quartz blocks. You want to skip a block over here. You want to skip a block and go up three, just like that. And place a push deep slate stair in front. And place one underneath, like that. And place a button over there. Want to skip another block like this, place a stair in front, wall, button, and then place a lever underneath and flip it, and then place a chain underneath. You don't place a chain there. You go on the second firework star over here, go up three blocks, place a wall, stair, wall, and then skip a block again, and do the same thing again. And there you go. Get rid of these blocks, get your buttons, grindstone, and end rod. You want to place a grindstone underneath, an end rod underneath, and a button underneath. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Then want to grab your birch fence, your birch items, plus your lever. You then skip nine blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And place fence like that, fence like this, and fence like that. Then, place a birch stair like this, and then a fence underneath, and then underneath the fence, 
and place a lever. And then you just want to cover the sides with birch signs. No. Or just one. Nope, it was only two. Dang it. You also want to grab some yellow concrete. Place your there like that so you only want two fences place signs across like that fence underneath and then underneath the fence place a lever and flip it and on top and underneath the fences you place birch buttons Then, want to go over here, you skip to the bot, you skip to the middle, place Dan, and then place G E R like that, so it spells danger. Get smooth quartz stairs like this. I forgot once again. Okay. Damn. Excuse me, my battery is low. But then you want to skip, I'm pretty sure, two blocks on this side, like that. You place a stair on top, and then do that again and then you want to do the same thing again but just place two like this two like you skip a block and then place the same thing once again Grab your weighted pressure plates, heavy weighted pressure plates. And place them all in there on top in the computer section. Now this is really up to you, it could be any painting you want, but I choose to be like this, so if you want to go my style, you can do that, but if you want to do your own style, you can choose any random painting you want. So, for this side, oh yeah, you want, no, no, yeah, you want this painting, and for this side, you want that painting, and in the middle, you want this painting. There you go. Grab, you want to grab out your black wool. You 
then want to place black hole like this. And in the corner, you want to place an ochre frog light underneath and place a carpet on top. You grab out your yellow blocks, you place five, and then pretty sure. Okay, yeah. You s then skip four blocks one, two, three, four, and place five like that. You then skip a block underneath both of them and place yellow concrete like this and skip a block underneath again and place three on each side or six. And then I'm pretty sure you can get rid of your yellow concrete. And on all the supports, you place seven, so that's four, and that's seven. You want to place seven polished blackstone brick like this. You then want to cover all these blocks like that, and then place polished blackstone bricks like this. You then want to place one, two, three, I'm pretty sure. Nope, it's full. Never mind. You want to place four stairs like that. You place upside down stairs. Four more stairs. More upside down stairs. And more stairs. Grab out your slabs. And then you place, you want to make a 4x4 four four blackstone slab platform like this. I'm gonna place a stair like this. I'm gonna place four more stairs like this. And you wanna basically keep placing it until you get to the bottom.
place stairs like this and place upside down stairs underneath like that. And then you want to grab out your spruce trap doors. And you want to cover the rim of the blackstone, post blackstone brick platform. And then place polish, you want to place stone brick walls like this. And then on the corner, so on the corner of this platform, you want to go to the top and place ochre frog lights like that, and over here like this. And then you want to place trapdoors underneath all of them, or on the side, not underneath. There you go. Go in the center of your stone brick, so basically you want to make sure that there's three on each side. And you want to place smooth quartz stairs like this. And then go like this. And then you want to grab your birch trap doors like this. And make sure that the handles are inverted to each other. You want to grab out your paintings again. You want to crouch and place a stair. Yeah, you want this painting. And then... Grab out your port stairs again. You want to place a stair like this and stair like, and then a port stair like this. You place some like that. You place a lever and flip it. You place a flower pot so it looks like a drink. And then in the middle, you want to place a polish blackstone pressure plate, like this. You then want to get a spruce stair. Now, actually, you want to grab a rail first. Put a rail there. Break a block underneath. Get rid of the rails. Grab a minecart. And break the rail underneath. Get rid of your minecart. Place back your block. Place three blocks like this. I think you get rid of your your pressure plates. Grab out your spruce stair again. You can get rid of it. Then you want to grab pistons and a redstone block.
basically want to get it so that the piston is facing upside down, which I am having a lot of trouble. So on second thought, you actually need to grab your screw stair once again. Again, this on the second layer. Get rid of your stair. Yep. You want to place a bunch of blocks underneath and activate it. There you go. Get rid of the blocks. Cover that, and then push that in the minecart, and place it on the trapdoor. Now you can actually sit in your minecart, and you can then get rid of these. You also cover the back, so it doesn't look as weird. And you want to grab out your paintings again. skip two blocks, and then you go this way, go up two blocks, oh my god, okay. you want to cover something like this, damn it, nope, nope, yes, you want this bluish painting, and once you're done with that, you want to go in the, you want to go in your corner, grab your barrels, your diorite walls, your glass, your chisel quartz, your smooth quartz slab, and grab your lever. Place a barrel, a barrel like this, and two diorite walls up. Smooth chisel ports, and then glass on top, and then a smooth ports, and then flip the lever down so it looks like a water dispenser. And then get rid of these. And you want to grab the rest of your materials. Do not place the lever there. And you want to grab your red shulker box and you want to grab a red nether brick. You can get rid of your glass, your diorite walls, your black stone. Bricks, fences, chains, buttons, end rod, blackstone button, weighted pressure plate, trapdoor sign, I'm pretty sure, grindstone, blackstone brick, birch stairs, Black concrete, black wool. You want to keep your paintings. No, actually, you can get rid of your paintings. Your black stone, like that. And you don't need your quartz slabs. But you also want to grab a normal item frame and a netherite axe. 
You want to keep your loom. Go to your first block over the stair and flick these trap doors. You then want to grab two gray shulker boxes like this. And then, once you. Uh, so you want to grab your brown shulker box, red shulker box, loo, and trap door. So then you want to place a barrel like, no, you want to go, you want to place a straight barrel like this and a barrel like that. And then once you're done, place trap doors on top. Ah! You then want to place brown, red, Shulker boxes, place a chest on top, place a loom like this, brown, red, and then cover the rest with brown, with uh, spruce trap doors. And then, once you finish. Grab your bricks and your quart chisel quartz blocks and make a 8x8, a 3x3 hole like this and then place a quartz brick in the middle. Cover, the, cover this side with quartz like that. Then cover the top like this. Quartz brick. Put another brick in here. Place a lever like that. And then cover it with glass panes. Grab your barrels and your spruce trap doors again. Then want to place two barrels like this, a barrel like that, and a barrel on top. Once you're done with that, you then want to grab your trap doors again. This side with spruce trap doors. Cover the cover the east sides with spruce trap doors. And cover this side with spruce trap doors. And then you cover the top with spruce trap door. And there you go. And on this side, you want to place barrels like this. And there you go. And now for the last part, which is the lighting, you want to scatter frog lights and carpet on top. Or if you want a cheaper alternative, you could use glowstone, or you could use shroom light, or you can use glowstone. Both work as well, but I just choose to use frog lights. But really, this is up to you. So you basically want to scatter as much as possible so that the area is light 
and you can do as much as you want, or as little as you want, just so it doesn't make as much mobs spawn, and, your, and this place goes, and this place blows up. And I'm, well, low battery. And there you go. You then want to get rid of every single thing you have over here, except for the loom, and grab out your materials over here. Pretty sure. So in your loom, you want to place light gray, a light gray poly like that. Field malts in like this. And then grab your gray dye and cover, it, cover the border like that. And basically, grab your gray banner. here, grab your glow ink, red banner, put glow ink like there, put some red, and then cover the top with yellow banners. And that ends our building tutorial. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit the like button and please consider subscribing. It's free and you can always change your mind. This video took a long time to make. I'm really slacking off on videos, but I will get this done soon. But anyways, bye!